Hi there! In this video, we will set up our very first monitor using the Distill web app. To access the web app, head over to the URL of the web app. Here, you'll land on the view of the watchlist, which is a collection of all the monitors that you have created. Within the watchlist is the Add Monitor button. Click on it. Here, you have the option to set up various types of monitors. In our case, we will be tracking a web page, so I will go ahead and click on the web page. This opens up the source page. Here, I will paste the URL of the page that I want to track and click on the Go button. The visual selector loads. This is a tool within Distill that allows you to make selections on the portions of the page that you want to track. To ensure the visual selector is on, toggle between the on and off buttons. You can use the gear icon to expand the view of the selector panel. You can make selections by using your cursor and clicking on the section of the page that you want to track. You can see that the selection has been made when it is highlighted in blue. You can expand, contract, or even delete the area of your selection. Once you've made your selection, ensure that it is the same by verifying it within the preview of the visual selector. Once you're done making your selections, you can click the Save Selections button. Instead, if you're interested in monitoring the entire web page, you can do so. Click on More Options, where you'll find the option to select the full page. In our case, we are just going to monitor the price, so we'll click Save Selections. The Options page opens up. Here, you can configure and set up your monitor in more detail. You can choose the device on which you want to run checks on. In our case, the web app will by default choose the Distill Cloud servers to run checks. You can schedule intervals for checking the web page. In our case, we will check the page every hour. Click on the Add Action button to choose the alert mode through which you want to get your notification. The availability of some options depends on your subscription plan. Once you're done making selections, click on the Save button. Now your monitor is created, and it will appear within the watch list. To view the change history that your monitor is tracking, you can click on the preview of the monitor. I have another monitor that I set up earlier. To view the change history of your monitor, click on the preview. This loads the change history of the monitor. You can see the changes highlighted in green. You can click on Explore Diff to further compare and navigate through changes. You can see that any deleted text is highlighted in red and newly added text is highlighted in green. I hope this video gave you an understanding of how to set up a monitor on the Distill web app